Welcome back, folks. It is I, your illustrious host, Lord Zedek Tikradius Horu. And as always, it is wonderful to see you all again, all for the first time, if you're just tuning in. Last time, we took on a case for this man, Sunri, who was, is being convicted of killing a Sith woman, Alasa, by the Manan government. Also, last time, we found proof that he did do it. But I will say this. There is cut content which states that like there's a data pad cut content which states that she was going to kill him because he doesn't have uh, useful information I'm going to go have a word with Sunray to see if I can really do anything Jolly! Coming to check in on an old man? I must confess. Soon, old friend. Oh, I grow weary of staring at these four bare walls. We have to clear up. Go ahead. Were you and Alasa having an affair? We, uh, I... Oh... No, what? I know it was wrong, but I'm a weak man. Alasa was beautiful and young. How was... Please. I know I made it. I did it. But found out later that she was dead. I don't deserve to go to jail just for having an affair, do I? Go. I know you're guilty, Sunri. I've got the Republic's data recording. So the truth is out. I never meant to kill her, you know. When I found out she was a Sith spy, you... she didn't know I had found out. So I waited until she fell asleep. And then I... I killed her. Simple, really. They found the illegal monitoring device that the Sith had planted in the room, altered its recording to hide my part in it, and cleared up the evidence. I figured that was the end of it. But the Sith found out the truth, didn't they? The Sith must have been spying on me and Alasa, trying to make sure she wasn't a double agent. They must have seen the Republic spies getting rid of all the evidence. And so they planted their own evidence. Alasa must have stolen that hero's cross from me long ago and given it to her Sith masters like some kind of trophy. I just thought I'd misplaced it. But when the cross turned up on her body, I knew the Sith had... You're guilty, Sunri. <sighs> Confess. You think I'm some kind of monster, don't you? All I did was kill a Sith! That's different, Sunri, and you know it. We don't kill them in cold blood while they sleep. I don't see how the two of us are any different. She was a spy. She was using me to get information so Malik's army could destroy the Republic. She deserved to die. Killing your lover if, while she sleeps is murder, even if she is a Sith. If I confess, I'm looking at 20 years in prison. And the Otto City officials might even place Colto sanctions on the Republic Embassy. Without Colto, how can we treat the injuries to our soldiers on the front lines? expose you. I'm glad you decided to see reason in this. If I'm convicted, it could cause... Sunry. You're a piece of shit. I kill Sith that attack me. They come after me. But I wouldn't kill one if I was sleeping with her. And she was asleep. Oh, 
I want to begin Sun Sunray's trial now. Yes, let's begin. I will find Sunry innocent. It is an honor to see justice served, and I will see Sunry is ex. Impossible! You are feareth me, the well-known Pazak player. I wonder if we can trust the word of a, a gambler as reliable testimony. Do not undermine the witness. Of course, Your Honor. Feareth me, what did you see the night of the murder? Well, I came out into the hallway after hearing the blaster shot and saw Sunry over there limping down the hall out of the building. <laughs> A very obvious point, Your Honors. The accused was seen leaving the scene of the crime after the blaster that killed Elasa was fired. <laughs> Did you actually see the murder happen? You mean, actually see him kill her with my own eyes? Well, no, but I don't think there could have been anyone else there. How could Sunry have harmed her if he was a cripple? Well, he was moving pretty fast running away, but yeah, I mean, how could he kill a Sith warrior in combat? I don't know for sure. <laughs> No additional questions. Yes. Glupor the Rodian, you were staying in the hotel the night of the murder. This is clear then that Sunri left the Did you see Sunri kill Elasa? Isn't the medal of the crime scene too obvious, the clue? Did you plant the medal on Elasa? Don't do it, Glupor. Lies! Slap! Glupor wonky. No. Yes. You, Elora, are Sunri's lawful wife. Your husband was a hero in the last war between the Sith Empire and the Republic. He was crippled in that war. Do you not believe he'd blame the Sith for his injury? Yes. 
I guess he would. And there you have motive. Sunri seeks revenge on the Sith for what they did to him. Sunri was a cripple. Could he have killed Alasa? He was a good man, but his injuries pained him terribly. I don't think he could have beaten her or anything like that. But a blaster? Sunri was a Republic war hero, wasn't he? Yes. He fought against the Sith in the last war. He fought bravely, and was even awarded the Hero's Cross. I don't know how much that means to the Sith, or to your Selkath, your honors. But in the Republic, it is awarded only to the bravest, most val- The kind of man who earns that medal would not kill someone in cold blood. Was it true your husband was having an affair with Alasa? Yes. Yes, it was true. He was having an affair with that Sith harlot. It seems painfully obvious that he killed... He'd been seeing her for some time, I think. But he said he was going to change. He'd gone there that night to end it. We talked the night before and he'd promised. But now things have become so very complicated. I wish to call forth Are you a war hero, Mr. Sunray? Yes, that's right. And I don't regret it either. The Republic needs its heroes. Indeed. Would you say that you Of course I hate them! Trying to take over the galaxy every chance they get, killing millions of innocents? Pure politics. Were you in Alassa's room on the- Well, yes, I, I had been having an affair with Alassa and my wife, yes. But I realized how wrong I'd been. You were having an affair with a Sith. You wanted to end it quickly and quiet. No, I- I think we can see the answer clear enough, Mr. Sunry. <laughs> Lassa was a Sith spy, wasn't she? Hmm. You were going to in the affair with the Sith object? Yes, I think they would. They wouldn't want to lose one of their sources, even though I didn't give them anything. They... they might have killed her for her failure. Or they might have thought she'd turn against them or something like that. The Sith Empire is not the barbaric institution you portray it to be. <laughs> How could Alasa have gotten hold of your medal? I don't know. The medal had gone missing some time ago. I never found out what happened to it. It's possible the Sith had stolen it and had it planted on the body. Supposition, Your Honors? Alasa was a Sith spy, wasn't she? Of course she was. Why would a young, beautiful Sith woman get with an old cripple like me? I think the facts in this case are very straightforward. Sunri was having an affair. Witnesses saw Sunri fleeing the scene, and material evidence places him there. I am confident that any inform. No one actually witnessed the murder. Oh, that doesn't mean a thing. He was there, running...
Elasa was a spy and the Sith... Nah. Sunri was ending the affair, so the Sith killed her. The Sith would not leave the medal of her killer clutched in her hand. <laughs> Elasa was a spy and the Sith are framing Sunri. Nah, I'm complete. Your honors, no! Oh, Sunry. Elora, thank you for saving me. I don't know how I can repay you. Elora and I are go I and the Republic will not forget what you've done for us. Thank you. You know, that's actually quite a piss-off moment, you know? It's just like... Well, you see... We... Like... I did kill her, but we're doing... But we have to lie in order to get everything to work perfectly. Right, I need to go furthermore. I'm gonna go do... I'm gonna go race the swoop track. Fuck it. Swoop racing, here I come. I'm not light. I'm not light side anymore. So I can no longer wear that. Hooked at Jax is insane. He just smashes through everything to the finish. I guess we should expect that from a Gamorian. Out of my way. In let. Your words are all sound and fury, signifying nothing. You dare mock me? If it wasn't for the Selkath laws, I'd teach you proper respect. Why the fuck should I respect you? Hell, why should I respect the Republic at this point? Swoop fan. Takum justak miki gravel mogo. Kachi chu ai thao donga. Mut. Yeah, screw off. Kipuna na bon sha. Kava dumpa kupali. Elwato. Lindus vopalas kaga toste fior. Kom. I'm interested in racing. Kiatra to alfa kirpani. Yeah, I won the season opener into Honteras. And ready to race. There you go.
say it's been it's been a week or so since I've last done this. Wow, do they really need to do all that? Come on, come on, get her over with, get her over with. Want. I don't waste time with fans. So if this is about an odd wait a minute, you're no fan. You're the racer that killed my time. Why should I talk to you? Hmm. We'll get it over. Don't hurry. You beat my time. Twenty-two fifty. I can beat that if I don't hit anything. I 
will race and I'll win. I think I beat it by six nanoseconds. You're gonna be the talk of Manon for a while. Nobody's gonna get anywhere near your time. Racers like you are why I watch the sport. You dominated the whole field. It was exu- Could I get an auto print? You just had the quickest rise to sector champion that I've ever seen. Wow, I bet you could have won on Terrace with times like that. It's a shame we'll never know. What is your business exactly? Are you with the Sith? Kachi chu aitha hodunga. Yin kin kuno bamul. Don't you think the Sith might take exception to that? Takum justak miki grabal mogo. Kachi chu aitha hodunga. Tulpa tong hai tuam jiji yu malith pa ang yin kotu. Tulpa da bunk walia gando den. 
I can see how it would be very stressful. Tong hai tuam jiji yumalith pa ang inkotu. Tolba da bung kwal ya karatum pa kun pa yiya moka pa ata. Bona nai kachu. Takum just tak miki grabal mogo. Kachi chu hai thao dong. Out of my way. Maybe I should split you open from head to toe. How's that for wrath? Are you threatening me? It's illegal to try to start a fight and not. <laughs> the Sith and I are exchanging meaningless taunts. <laughs> I'm very con sorry, Constable. Won't happen again. The Selkath claim neutrality, but you're always giving preferential treatment to the Republic. What embassy? Woo! That was an exciting time you turned in. Nobody else had a chance. All right then. So. We've done the swoop race, we've gotten that taken care of. Put the bitch in her place, because, you know... Yeah. Alright, let's go down. Yeah, this is the way. I don't know, I feel bad about letting him off scot-free. I mean, technically, as it stands right now, we have no idea if she was going to kill him or not. They say that they took out the whole... You fucking... Never mind. I thought he said, come over to here. There it goes. All right, we're down here. Antidote kits. Well, that's not exactly the best welcoming you've ever seen. How? How did you get in? Did they send another submersible? Quick, we have to get out of here. We have to get away. Who are you? No! No, we have no time. We have to leave now. I managed to close the door after they killed. I have to find the star map. I don't know what you're talking about. I've never seen any map. Just stinking. The cell calf, they went crazy. They started killing anything that moved. Someone must have triggered the defense systems too, because all the droids activated as well. I was one of the mercs the Republic sent down here to find out what happened. We came down and secured the first couple of rooms, and the cell calf came out, screaming and croaking their fishy little war cries. The cell calf? They swarmed out and over us. There was no way we could stop them. So we ran. But hardly any of us made it. I locked the door behind us, but... But the others had already left in the submersible. The sharks. The Feroxa out there, and... Worse. I heard an explosion shortly after the submersible left. They...
I didn't see anything. That doesn't mean it's not still out there. I have to get you... I have to get into the station. No! I locked the door so the silk has... You call yourself a mercenary? If you go in there, you... if you want to die, then go. You won't hear me mourning for you. I'll stay here and be safe until... Lovely. So, where's the door? Credits, 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 thermal detonator. Alright folks, I'm going to go ahead and call that an episode there for today. You all have a wonderful evening, and as always, I've been your illustrious host, Lord Zedek Tigradius Haruk, and remember, I love you all. Good night.